hello guys welcome back to design tech hub youtube channel and welcome to another episode of an amazing video in this video i'm gonna be showing you guys how you can blend in image into backgrounds like a pro but before we dive into the video if you are new to my if you are new to my youtube channel please kindly click on the subscribe button put on the notification bell to get notified whenever i upload new and amazing videos and as for the returning viewers thank you i really appreciate so uh like i said earlier i'll be showing you guys uh, how you can blend in image images into backgrounds like a pro please sit carefully and watch the video with your attention please don't forget to like this video drop the comment if you have any, if you have any question concerning this video i will answer to all question so let's uh let's bring in the back, the background we want to use So this is the background. This is the background we want to blend image in. The background has been imported. So the next thing is to bring in the image we want to blend into the background. Yeah, just to locate your folder where you have the image, then bring in the image you want to blend. So let's let's use this image. So this is the image we want to this, this is the image we want to blend into the background. Yeah. So the next thing is to as the image is in blue, we can uh, make the background blue as well. We can change the color. We can uh, change the color of the background just by clicking on this. Then you select who. Then you can change the color to any color you want to use. So like you can see, let's leave it at blue like this. So if we want to blend in this image into the background, just uh, go to shape, select shapes. You can resize the shape to fit to fit in the for the screen. So after that, move on to gradient. As we will be using gradient, move on to gradient. Then select on this applause icon here. Select on this and click on this color icon. This is selected, click on OK. This, you click on this, select on this color icon and drag this down. You drag it down just like I've done now, then click on OK. You can change the color for this one, you can change it to blue color as the background is in blue color. So the background is in blue color. So just like this, that's it. Just because we've changed the color, we've changed the color for the background, we have to receive the background. So let me receive the background save as image so the background has been saved let me make uh, this image is visible okay so the uh, shape the fading gradient we've just created make sure it is selected then move on to texture click on texture then click on this uh, gallery we will be texturing this fading gradient with that background we've just saved the background the same background you are using you will use the background to texture the reading gradient so by clicking on texture and click on this gallery icon then you select the background cut out the particular place you want to use then click on this then click on this check mark you can see the back, the background but this is not free. this is not where free the background is not on the reading gradient very well. just click on enable you can see that then let's drag this down if it is not where if, it, if this is not showing where you can just come back to your edit you can edit the shape the color the reading green click on the plus icon then bring in this a little bit so you can see you can see how i've just i blending the image into the background please if you find this video if you find it helpful if you find it uh, helpful for you Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button put on your comment i put on your notification bell to get notified whenever i upload new and amazing content and don't forget to like and comment your question if you have any i will attend to the question thanks for watching